Hello guys, this is a battery drain test between Samsung Galaxy S22 and Galaxy S21. This year, Samsung decided to make the basic S22 model smaller size than its predecessor. Of course, that also led to shrinking some battery size also, right? S22 on the right side has 3700 mAh battery capacity whereas S21 has 4000 mAh battery capacity. Both devices are set with the similar settings. Especially brightness settings is exactly the same. In this video, you will find it if this makes uh, any difference on the regular usage. Maybe you want to have this uh, basic model and are afraid of the battery capacity. So make sure to watch till the end. And of course, do not forget to subscribe to my channel, alright? Let's start with uh, some social media. Right? Everywhere is about the Ukraine. I pray for peace. No one should suffer. Life is very precious. I pray for everyone. The world should be in peace. After 20 minutes of using TikTok, both devices lost around 5% of their battery. Now let's start with YouTube. After 41 minutes, both devices have exactly the same percentage of battery remaining. You can see 92% of the battery remaining uh, in the both devices. Now I start with the heavy tax. Let's start with anti two benchmark. Uh, this benchmark this is very heavy load performing. Let's do a high load commuting test. This test lasts for 45 minutes. This is also a very heavy loading tax. Uh, think about it, what can happen? And, and 8 minutes remaining. Now you can see the actual battery percentage difference. S22 has come down to 70%, whereas Galaxy S21 has 74% remaining. At this point, both devices seem to have a similar surface temperature. After 1 hour and 37 minutes, S21 has 5% more battery power. In meantime, I will do more uh, benchmarking and uh, this will be like marathon. <laughs> to be honest, I just want them to finish their battery fast. This content is quite boring to make, so make sure to like this video. Okay? Two hours and five minutes pass. The S22 has 55% uh, battery and S21 has 59% battery. After what, I begin to test Netflix. I set the brightness and volume similarly. In the background, there is also exactly the same movie. After 3 hours, uh, S22 has 47% and S21 has 51%. The difference is just 4%. Then I set the device in always on display mode. Let's see this. Let's see the difference also. Uh, 50 minutes of AOD mode, the, the battery differences are also similar like before. Now you can see the web browsing and also YouTube playing in the split section. After 4 hours, with all the stops, I start to set the split mode a little differently. I want to force these devices so maybe I can play games and run YouTube together. Playing the game is impossible I, I guess. Let's put anti two benchmark in the split section. After 42 minutes of heavy heavy tax, the S22 is down to 27%. And whereas S21 has 35%. The margin is 8%. Now you can see I start to record the video in the 8K. This is also a very hard task. 
In the meantime, I change the position of the device for a fair competition. After 35 minutes of 8K video shooting, the S22 has 9% remaining and S21 has 18%, S21 has almost 10% more, right? So what I do only daily multitask, things which are basic, just web browsing and YouTube playing. And after 5 hours and 29 minutes of different kinds of tests and stops, the Galaxy S22 goes to sleep. <laughs> Well, 21 has 15% more. With 15% more battery remaining, you can watch YouTube videos for 15 minutes on S21. So in this test, I use many, many kinds of stops to drain the battery quickly. I have given a timeline in the description, so make sure to check which parts took more battery. In the conclusion, if you use S22 for a daily tax, you wouldn't find any differences. Some things like browsing the internet, using social media, TikTok, YouTube, Netflix. Uh, S22 is neck to neck. With S21 although having smaller battery capacity, I'm quite surprised to find it that it's almost neck to neck with the S21. Uh, but when you do heavy tasking such as playing games or some other multitasks, then S22 drains more battery than S21. In so much, uh, in so many heavy stops, S22 seems faster and more powerful. Maybe Exynos 2200 is power hunger, and it also it was also performing uh, more better than S21. So, in my personal experience, I do not have any issues with the S22 in terms of battery power. I can keep all day, even using heavily. There is no need to worry. I hope you are clear. If any confusion, let me know in the comment section. Thanks for watching. I will catch you in the next 